final football practice before the Beach High School season starts tomorrow night is happening on the field behind us right now. But the team will not be able to play any games in the stadium for the foreseeable future. The visitors bleachers have been removed from Shackle Island Stadium after strong winds and heavy rain caused them to collapse Tuesday morning. That could have been me sitting up there on the bleachers in the field. Michael Dobson says he's lucky to have not been watching his grandson play when they came crashing down. That could be dangerous with, you know, with the kids getting on the bleachers and them collapsing and getting somebody hurt. Engineers the school brought in have determined the stadium is not safe. So the Buccaneers will play at least their first game at another school. But Michael's concerned they didn't catch this issue before the collapse. They need to have the maintenance crews or somebody need to check stuff like that. Michael says he's going to be on alert until he knows every stadium has been inspected to keep something like this from happening again. When I go up on the bleachers, I might sit on the front row. Other parents and students I talked with today said they're concerned that this issue might keep them away from home for the entire season. But school leaders say they're working on a temporary fix to reopen this stadium while also inspecting every other stadium across the district. In Sumner County, Brendan Tierney, WSMV4.